A governorship aspirant in Gumbi State is challenging politicians to run issues-based campaigns and not play dirty politics. The former Deputy Speaker of the House of Reps and now Senator Bayero Nafada says he has a strategy to boost rural development, education and agriculture. And TVC's Larry Adeyemi has details. Allegations, misinformation and violence. These have become prominent features in politics across Nigeria. Former Deputy Speaker of the House of Representatives and Governorship Aspirant in Gumbi State, Bayero Nafada, is urging his colleagues, politicians, to desist from what he describes as dirty politics. He rather wants campaigns to be focused on issues, vision, and development. Dangbombo has achieved a lot, and whoever wants to come and be governor, you should not be looking at the mistake of Dangombo. You should be telling us what you, are, what you have for the people of Gombe. Gombe is part of the Northeast. I am from Nafada. I'm no neighboring uh, Yobe state. Yobe is one of the series that, that has a uh, problem of uh, Boko Haram. But today, under his leadership, Gombe is safe. Gombe is the safest state in the Northeast. This shows you how he is, how his IQ is working. This shows you how his his IQ is working. It's not about uh, it's not about uh, uh, Gombe is far away from Maiduguri. No, it's because of the visionary leadership of Dan Gombe. Senator Nafada also sheds light on his vision for the people of Gombe State. He is confident that. His strategy to boost rural development, education and agriculture is what Gombe needs. There are a lot of small, small industries that you can bring. There are a lot of things like this um, rice meal. You have small, small rice meal. If you go to China, you will bring them and uh, people will be... If you bring like 1,000 or 10,000 uh, rice meal, small, small rice meal, that will engage about uh, 50,000 people. And these 50,000 people will be ready to send their children to school. So we'll try to do that. And on the road network, we will continue from where he stopped. Some aspirants of the All Progressive Congress recently questioned the performance of the Dankwambu led administration in Gombe State. In response, several residents of Gombe have risen in defense of Dankwambu and his legacy. Larry Adeyemi, TVC News, Gombe.